All right, guys. So uh, the father of Huey Fury, Peter Fury, and former trainer of Tyson Fury. And I don't know if he trains him anymore, but I remember that, like they had some type of fallout. But he's also the uncle of Tyson Fury. Uh, he talked about, you know, the fact that Andy Ruiz is once again traveling abroad. Uh, this is his second back-to-back -back fight traveling abroad, right? First was going to the United States, New York City, fighting there. And now second is going to Saudi Arabia. So two back-to-back -back fights that are not in the UK. And this is what Peter Fury had to say. Uh, about what's his name, to, uh, Anthony Joshua going abroad. If he was in Joshua's position, he would have held the fight in the UK. We've gone abroad because we're not bothered about going abroad, and we've had to do it anyway. If I would have a chance, and every time I've come out, I've had 100,000 fans here. I'm going nowhere. Why go when it's all here? I would want it here. I'd remain here. I'd say that that's it. Call me whatever you want. I'll stay here. You've got to go out there quite a bit beforehand. Get used to the climate. Don't start training outside because there will be nothing left of you. Just go outside and have a walk in the evenings when it's cool down. When it's cool down. down stay in the hotel 24-7. Uh, don't go out to the hotel. So he's basically saying that if he was Anthony Joshua, he would stay in the UK. Have 100,000 you know, screaming fans feed you that energy. Uh, that's what Anthony Joshua wanted himself. He wanted to, like I said, he, he came out and said that he would want it to have it happen in Cardiff, Wales. He wants to feel the energy. That's what he kept talking about, Anthony Joshua. I love that energy. You feed off that energy. He wanted to fight Andy Ruiz in Wembley, or not, not Wembley, in Principality Stadium over there in Wales. I believe that it, it's in Wales. To, he wanted to feed off the energy because he says that helps him, right? He fed off the energy when he fought Vladimir Klitschko. So he wanted that, and Peter Fury agrees, as you can see here, with, you know, he says 100,000 fans. But obviously, the, the the reason this fight had to happen in Saudi Arabia was uh, because J Ruiz refused to go over here. And remember, he does have a say in the matter because he is the champion. It's not, if Anthony Joshua was the champion right now, he would have had the fight happen in, in the UK, right? Let's say the fight was competitive and Anthony Joshua won, and then they're just doing an instant rematch. He will be having the fight in the UK, okay? The fight will be happening right now in the UK. But because Ruiz was the champion and because he refused to go to the UK, that's the only reason why they're going uh, to Saudi Arabia. Uh, so, yeah, I do agree. A lot of people, uh, you know, a lot of uh, b people in boxing have said this stuff about Anthony Joshua where the rematch should take place. They, a lot of people have said that they want, they think it should take place in the UK. And I understand why. Because that's where Anthony Joshua is comfortable. That's where his fan base is. And like Anthony Joshua said himself, he didn't need to go to the US, right? He just went to the US because uh, they were trying to build his profile. But realistically, I said this in the past many times, he could really just stay in the UK all his career. Uh, so, yeah. Only because Andy Ruiz was the champion is why he st he went to he's taking this fight to you know the the Saudi Arabia.